it's just to help the surrounding Ignatius community and live out uh, what it means to be a man for other uh, and just just come closer to the community and be close with God. Really, it's part of our mission as part of the school to, you know, you know, really, you know, have care and concern for the poor in our community. And that's what's really important about the food drive is that, you know, it's a faith-filled response, you know, to this call for care and concern for the poor and unfortunate. Uh, we deliver to people that we know through Labra that have moved uh, indoors. There were five deliveries, um, and so these people are indoors, but they don't have all the food that they usually need, so we threw them baskets and uh, gave them stuff to eat. And the last person we went to, there was about five people living in the house, and they were all really grateful because they said uh, they hadn't had real butter in a while and they hadn't had paper towels in a while. So um, it meant a lot to all these people we were delivering. It's a stop. It's an a moment that we can, a day that we can use to take a moment to ourselves and for ourselves um, and spend it in a, a form of prayer that we don't usually get to spend time in. It doesn't really take much to walk in and give them some food, but when we come in with that basket and talk with them, it means a lot more to them than the effort that it takes for us to do it. Now that we're all on break, the first thing we want to do is just sleep in. We didn't get that opportunity today, but in a good way. We um, instead were able to help 700 plus people um, enjoy their Christmas, and seeing the joy on their faces uh, really led to a joy in our hearts. And that was an amazing thing to see and reflect on. Uh, that I, every year I keep coming back for a reason, and it's for that joy.